How you doing, brother? See Tina Rose. Brother Ezekiel. Look, y'all, something real deep just happened. Me and Zeke was the first to come to the scene. This is no joke what we're doing. This is not a skit. This is not an act. This is the real deal. Me and Zeke was in our house, and all of a sudden we heard this loud boom. And right in front of our house, because we live right next door to each other, we run out, and from our amazement, from the shocking of the night, we found a car being tore down. As you can see, you see the cops right here and everything behind us. There was a young man in his car. We couldn't find a young man yet, but Zeke was trying to put out the fire. And um, we got the whole footage, y'all. Please check this out, man. This is a deep thing, man. This is deep. Only the power of God. And when Zeke was Only. when Zeke was trying to get his young man God, he was saying no. But he was like, his body was twisted up like. Man, we shocked right now. Just, just check the scene out, y'all. Check this out. <coughs> Jesus. Yeah, somebody got a wreck over here. We got uh, Zeke trying to get it out. Hey, Zeke, did you get the rest of it? You got it? Jesus Christ, where the fun of you? Bear with us, y'all. This is some real stuff that we uh, wake up. This is, that's a mission again. Hey. Nigga, did you call 91? How many you got, Zeke? Man, where'd a person go? It's not in the car. What is the we uh? It's not in the car. Nah, man, they gone. They gone? It, I don't know, the man. Person got to be in the car. Nah, I, I thought I saw somebody in the passenger in the driver's seat, y'all. <laughs> man, I heard it, man. Man, bro, I heard it, bro. I, heard I know. Too. Did you just get home? No, I was, I was talking to you, be online. Did you get a seat? Hey man, we can have this thing blow up in our face, bro. This is it. Go, is he push it? Jesus Christ. Where did man, you saw the person ain't fly out the car, is he? You want that's it? Man, I I was asleep, man, when it happened. I mean I was I was I heard it, man. Man, you gotta stay away from that. Yeah. Man, they gone. They gone, man. They gone right here, bro. Oh my god! He alive. Sir. Sir. Oh my God. Jesus. Lord, Father God, Jesus. God, help us so, Father God. Lord, keep him, Jesus. Keep him, God, keep him. Stay with me, sir. Stay with me. Try not to move so much. Try not to move, all right? Try not to move. Just try not to move. Try not to move. Just be cool. Can you hear us? Jesus. You can hear me? You can hear me? Jesus. Jesus. He right here. Jesus. I seen a young boy's body, but um, this is the last of the aftermath of the car. Get all in, get all yeah. in, bro. Get all in. See it. The aftermath of the car. Y'all can see the whole thing, the whole interior. The other car that got it pretty much behind the big thing over there. Y'all can see the whole ambulance and truck behind us. But me and my brother came on out here, and um, you know we try to come for the young man aid. And God just, you know, I felt in my spirit. Soon it happened. The Lord said, "Go out there." Run! I, I run, and all of a sudden Zeke running. We meet. We collide into each other, trying to get this young boy saved. And as y'all can see, our mission never stopped, y'all. We can't sleep. This is what we do, y'all. Can't sleep. We can't sleep. God got us moving 24/7. I mean, if we ain't out there preaching, we already trying to save somebody. So this film called "Credit to the Grave." You never sleep. You never slept. The more, the whole moral of this story, y'all, is um, take life serious because you never know when God gonna call you home. That boy didn't know he was gonna ride, and all of a sudden this was gonna happen to him. So take life serious, y'all, because. 
you just never know when God called you. You never know. And then in the end, heaven or hell, you know, Amen. your destiny Amen. will call. So Amen. please, y'all, keep subscribing. It's been a long night, man. Golly, man, I don't know how I'm going to sleep tonight. Please keep subscribing. Amen.